Hey yo, what up people, this is your boy Jason J. Kex and today we are back with another video and in today's video guys, I have a special shoe for you, a pair of Jordan 1 Low and this is the Jordan 1 Low Philippine. Look at this shoe right here. These are really beautiful. And I'm going to review this shoe on today's video. But before we go into this, please let me ask you to go and do the thumbs up if you like the content. Also, go and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Activate the notification bell so you can be notified whenever I upload a video, which is every single day, guys. So, so go follow me on my Instagram and on TikTok as Jason J. Cakes. And now, let's begin this video. This Jordan 1 Low, just like the name says, is inspired in Philippines. That's why we have blue, red, and white on this shoe, just like on the Philippine flag. But this shoe that Nike and Jordan Brand create to honor the country of Philippines is really beautiful. As soon as I saw this shoe showing up on my J23 app, I was like, damn, I need to have these, because these are really beautiful. And this one released alongside with another one that I don't remember the name, but if this one right here, that one is a women's exclusive. This was the men's pair, but just the colorway and everything make me decide for this one instead of those ones. And of course, this one comes in men's size, which means that this one has my personal size. That one, nah, I'm a man's size 12. And the biggest size on this one is a man's um, 11 and a half. But if you want me to review those, I can do it for you. Just let me know in the comment section and leave a like so I can see that you really want to see that video as well. So continuing with this one, Nike says that these shoes also include premium material. That's what they said in the description of these shoes. But no, these shoes don't have premium material nowhere on these shoes. But the leather quality in these, even though it's not premium, it's a little better than the regular material quality that we have on any other Jordan 1 low. The regular ones, this is a special edition one. That's why you see a little increase on the material that it used for this one. I really liked it a lot. Something else about this shoe is that this shoe has some dope details like this color here on the swoosh. It's not one shade of red. It's actually two different tones. As we can see right here, we have a deeper shade of red than we have on this area of the shoe. Really dope, really dope. Also here on the blue area, we can see like this um, shining effect that is on the top and then fading to a more um, um, matte color here, really beautiful, really, really beautiful. Um, the midsole is white, pure white, just like the panel, the color, and the toe of the shoe. That's what we have here on the midsole, going through this beautiful, beautiful, icy bottom looking outsole. I really like the way the outsole looks. I know it's only gonna look like that while the shoe is brand new, unworn, DS, you know what I mean, but it's just dope to see this beautiful icy bottom that Nike and Jordan Brand included on this shoe. Really beautiful if you ask me. This shoe also have gray on the back of the shoe and on the top of the eyelids. And some dope details like the gold jumpman that this shoe has right here. This baby gold jumpman right here. And gold right here also in that eyelid right there. And on the back of the shoe. We have a gold Winx logo, another dope touch that looks super amazing on this shoe. These gold heats on this shoe are also included because of the Philippine flag. Really amazing pair of shoes, really amazing pair. And now that I show you the outsole, let me show you the insole. Because on the insole of this shoe, we have a blue insole with that red and gold 23 right there that looks amazing in my opinion, really beautiful. The way the insole looks on the shoe, I'm a super fan of what Nike and Jordan Brand did with this shoe. But this shoe has red, blue, and white, which are also the color of my country, Dominican Republic. And by the way, today in the Bronx is the Dominican Parade. I'm about to go there. Amazing, amazing this shoe to me because I can wear this shoe also in the Dominican Parade even though I know this shoe is inspired in the Philippine flag but these colors also match perfectly the colors of the flag of my country. That, by the way, let me talk a little bit about here. Nike and Jordan Brand, I think it's about time to give the Dominican community a pair of Jordan shoes. You feel me? Just like Nike did a few years ago with the Delomio um, Nike Air Force One. 
it's time to do a pair of Jordans. Could be a pair of Jordan 1, low size, whatever, but we need a pair of Jordans because the Dominican community love Jordan shoes. So it's about time to do a Delo Mio Jordan 1 or whatever of uh, the Dominican Republic Jordan. Whatever silhouette you want to give us, just do it because we really love um, Jordan shoes. And I'm talking about for all the Dominican community that I'm pretty sure that agree with me on these. We need a pair of Jordan shoes that represent the Dominican culture. It's just about time because we have given you a lot of love during the brand. So it's time for you to show some love to the Dominican community as well. Now guys, this is a beautiful shoe like I previously mentioned. The details, the quality is better than a regular pair of Jordan 1 Low. So that's a dope detail right there. And I'm pretty sure that if you see this shoe in hand, you're going to agree with me. Um, on the tongue, also we have a leather tone tag. This is not the regular um, tone tag that we have on Jordan 1s. And we have the Jumpman right there in white as well. I think it will be dope to have the Jumpman with some gold hits like we have here. Because the Jumpman right here disappears a little bit because it's all white, you know just some minor details but the shoe looks dope the shoe looks dope white laces are included with these shoes no extra laces for this one but the white laces look super good with this one with a white tongue and everything a really clean pair of shoes if you ask me but this is only my opinion and all i want to know is yours so let me know how you feel about this shoe in the comment section i give you the review quality and everything about this shoe now it's time to give you that dope on fit look and this amazing shoe so you can see how these babies look on feet but before we go into that let me invite you to subscribe to the channel I don't know if you haven't already hit the tone stop because you can really help me a lot just by leaving a like on this video with this YouTube algorithm and it's only gonna take one second of your time to leave a like so leave a like for your boy guys thank you a lot for watching the video oh by the way go follow me there on my Instagram it's Jason J Kicks if you enjoy sneaker content go follow me because I'm always uploading picture sneaker news all kind of sneaker content right there on my Instagram Jason J Kicks thank you guys again a lot for watching until the next one enjoy the own feed and goodbye Thank you.